Hello, hello everybody, pop 12 and I'm back with a, another video, and we're going to do another Minecraft video this time, because I have been really wanting to get back into my hardcore world, and really just, just grind it out, you know, I have some big plans for it, and I'm really excited to see where it goes, so, yeah, that, that, that's the only reason why I really want to do another Minecraft video, um, I know a lot of you are probably expecting another Genshin video, but you know, Minecraft is what Minecraft is, so I, that didn't make any sense, but you know what, we're here for it. I'm ready to play some Minecraft, so let's get right into it. Alrighty. So where we left off with the last episode, we have just finished, what is that? I see something over there. I think that's just a lava pool, but anyway, we have just finished building up this dirt wall that we got going on here to make this little semicircle-like thing, and my next plan is to build up, uh, like, like stone brick walls to give it, like, a fortification little outpost kind of vibe, and we're going to be looking out over the ocean here, so that's the plan, so I'm going to actually place this blast furnace. We're just going to place some stuff here. Alright. Just throw that in there for now. We're going to get rid of all of our junk. And then we're going to go on a big mining trip. Because I need to go get a bunch of stone to do this. So, yeah, that's the plan. Alright, so I think what we're going to want to do is... Hmm... I want to figure out where I want to start a mine. Actually, this is bothering me. I need to get rid of this. Let's disconnect that so it doesn't stay there any longer. Alright, so what I'm thinking is... I was thinking going down, like, straight into this. But I don't think I want to do that because I'm going to be building here. So, hmm, let's just start over here for now. We'll just start a nice little mine right here, and we can always cover it up later. So, I think we're just going to do one where we dig sh in a circle. So, we'll just do that. And then once we get a little deeper down, we'll dig just down, I guess. But yeah, the whole goal of this mining trip is to just get a ton of cobblestone. That way I can smelt it down, get some normal stone, then we can craft that into some stone bricks, and then we'll be good to oops, be good to go. So my pickaxe just broke. Okay, that's scary. I hate cave noises, but you know, just gotta deal with them. So my pickaxe just broke as I hit Y level 13, as you can see on the left hand side there. Or, I'm sorry, Y level 11, not 13. But uh, I'm just gonna make another cobble pickaxe real quick. So I can save my iron one, just in case I find diamonds or something. So, we're going to go up another level, actually. I don't like mining on level 13 or 11. God, I keep calling it 13. But, alright. So, we're just going to mine here, and we're just going to keep mining. And we're going to get cobblestone this way, and we're also going to find... Hopefully, we're going to find diamonds. That would be great, because, you know, it's you can never not use diamonds. So... If we find diamonds, that would just be awesome. And we're going to mine iron too, because I do need iron. I need tools, and I need armor. I found 16 raw iron so far. So, I hear lava over in this direction. Let's go this way. Alright, so I just found a cave. I didn't go very far. I was walking. I was going towards the lava, but I found myself a cave. I hear a lot of zombies. Really don't want to die to a freaking zombie in a hardcore world. That would just be sad. 
There's the lava. All right, let me make some more torches real quick. Bada bing, bum, 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 bum. All right, 16 more torches. What level are we at? We're at level 18. Get this iron here. Just leave that there. It's a natural light source, might as well keep it. Just means I don't have to waste a torch. Alright. Some more coal. Might as well top off. Alright, so we got 62 coal, so we're doing alright. We don't need no more. Right, this is pretty much a dead end cave. Alright. I missed a piece. Oh, I missed a whole few pieces. Nice. Hey, right, I'm going down here. And let's just keep going, I guess. <laughs> Ooh, I just got the notification. I'm at wide level 12, and I can hear that thunderstorm up there. That's crazy. Ooh, some redstone. But anyways, as I was saying, I just got Mr. Beast notification for a real-life squid game. I'm really excited. I cannot wait to watch that, actually. <laughs> I love Mr. Beast, man. He's such a good YouTuber. I, I really enjoy his content, and I've been really looking forward to this squid game video. He's been teasing it for, like, ever, like maybe a month now, and I'm ready to watch it. Alright, so I'm just mining out some cobble here, and I'm just getting really paranoid, I don't know why, but like these cave sounds and stuff, I didn't go very far, this is all the farther I got, ran into a big deep slate section, so I just started mining out off to the side here. I'm getting paranoid for some reason, so I'm just gonna start smelting some iron and so I can get some armor. Because I just keep having the feeling like, oh, a creeper's gonna walk up behind me and boom, I'm gonna die and then boom, it's all over. So, yeah, I'm gonna smelt some stuff and then we're gonna get some armor and then some tools. And we'll be chilling! So I'll be back once that's all smelted and I got a fresh set of armor. Alright, so I still got a lot to smelt yet, so we're just gonna let that smelt. But I hear a cave over in that direction. I got myself a full set of armor, got myself a sword, made an extra pickaxe. Shield. God. Cave noises are the scariest thing in this game, I swear to God. But anyway, yeah, see, you got some water and I hear some lava over here. So let's just go on over here. Let's see if we can get to this cave over here and then we can explore it. Oh wow, okay, it's a big ravine. See, that is why I want armor and a shield. The main reason I want a shield is because of these guys. I friggin' hate creepers, bro. Alright. Let's see what we got. Actually, I'm gonna make a bucket so I can get some of this water. So let me make a bucket real quick, and then I can get some of this water, and we can... Uh get rid of this lava then. Make the rest of these sticks into torches too. Alright. Uh, let's just go up here and get this water real quick. What's up, homie? See, I know creepers like to fall from ceilings, so I'm scared of that. I'm not even going to lie. It's so stressful playing on hardcore. I'm not even going to cat, especially when you only have iron armor. And creepers do a ton of damage on the hard difficulty. So, yeah. What am I stuck on? Okay, nothing nice. Yep, I'm going to grab this iron. Da -da 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 -da. What level am I at? I'm on 11. I could find diamonds in here. There's a zombie up there. Some lapis, too. That's... Uh, this 
this iron. Never have too much iron. Oh, Jesus, that scared the Lord out of me. Alright, so the cave. Ooh. Alright, so it goes off in both directions. Dude, if I don't find diamonds in here, then this game is rigged. This is literally diamond paradise. Lava everywhere. Why level 11? Like, there's gotta be diamonds in here somewhere, right? Like, that, that's just that's just how it goes, right? Unless I'm just unlocking. So far, nothing. I'm surprised, bro. Not one diamond. Like, what the heck, man? Oh, what the heck? There's more cave up there. Alright, let's just go up there, I guess. You know, now I'm thinking about it, I should have marked my coordinates for my house. So if I have to mine out of here, I know where I'm going. Get some torches. Dude, this just keeps going. Okay, never mind. This wraps around. It's part of the same cave. Ugh. Alright, nothing. See, I'm an adventurer. That's, that's one of my main reasons I don't... Well, I like caving, but it's it sucks when there's a massive cave because knowing me, I'm going to try to explore every nook and cranny of it, and then I'm going to lo lose my way and not be able to get out. So that's just that's just how I run. That's how I operate. So <laughs> knowing my luck, I'll probably get lost. I don't know if to just mine straight up or something. Yeah, but you know, it's okay. I'll be able to find my way home, hopefully. If not, you know what? All we did was place a bunch of dirt, so we can always just start over. But let's hope that doesn't come down to that. Alright, so I think I've explored every part of this cave. And then this goes back out to the ravine. Yeah, so let's just go down this way then. Let's see what's back here. So far, I think it's just a dead end. Actually, maybe not. Maybe it goes on? Nope, just a dead end. Alright. Wait. Wait, what? Huh? How did this get here? Okay. playing a risky game. Alright. I see cave that go down. That's just lapis. That's so sad. Long ravine. It's tall too. So I got a little bit of a cave going here. <gasps> Diamonds! Yes! Oh yes! Okay. Let's see. Yes. Yes! Yes! Give me! Oh, it feels so good. I love diamonds. Wow. Okay. Grab 
this lap is what we can do. Yes, I'm so happy. It's about time. Holy smokes, man. I thought we were never going to find any. Alright, let's go up here. Alright. You know what's funny? My friends always bash me for using a shield. They're always like, why do you always carry a shield around with you? Well, I can't tell you how many times a shield has saved my life. Like, it's uncanny how many times a shield has actually saved me. And, like, I don't know, they don't take up a lot of space, they're always handy, you know? Stop skeletons, stop creepers, stop anything from hitting you. It's, it, they're useful, <laughs> like, I don't understand why more people don't use shields. Or, yeah, so. Shield, one of my favorite objects in Minecraft. Don't know what I would do without it. I'd probably be dead. Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, yes. More diamonds. Okay. Yes. Oh, it's a big pocket, too. Oh, yes. Let's go. Is it an eight vein or a nine? vein. Oh, that, oh, yes. I love diamonds. Especially big veins of them. Let's go, dude. That puts me up to 12 already. That's a lot of diamonds. For early. It's only day two of this hardcore world. Well, it's not day two in Minecraft days, but it's day two for me recording. So, I consider that a win. Alright, let's not stand on the gravel and find it. Dude, another big, like, cave system. There's a creeper. Oh, hello. Bro, okay, I'm not ready to explore this. Or maybe I am. I don't know. I don't feel like I am. I'm also running out of wood. Honestly, I feel like... Oh, man, I'm kind of scared to keep exploring. I'm not scared, but, like, I'm... I feel like I should go home and... make improvements before I do anything else. Because I can get some obsidian now, and I can enchant. Now that I have lapis and stuff. Make myself a cra or an enchantment table. Anything I need would be books. Oh, gosh. Okay. Here's the plan. I think what I'm going to do is start heading back. I'm going to explore the rest of this little cave. And then I'm going to head back. Okay, this is not so little, but... Oh, my God. I, feel, I just feel overwhelmed now. Like, I love exploring, but holy smokes. I thought this was just going to be a simple mining trip. It's not. Put that there to know I already explored it. Alright, do I even... Dare hit me in that hole, bro. Alright. There's no... I don't see any diamonds here, so I don't think I need to go around it, but... Yeah. Normally I go around little pockets of lava like that, but I don't really feel like it right now. Dude. Dude, ske even skeletons do a ton of damage, and I got full iron armor, bro. That's crazy. Yikes, okay. This is good. That guy, he's shooting at you, bro. To get close to these guys. See, this is why I love shields, bro. Oh, oh my God. Okay, I was genuinely scared right there. Two and a half hearts. That's oh boy. Okay, what level are we at? Twenty. All right, we're not gonna find any diamonds up here, dude. Oh, I was actually scared right there. I thought I was going to die. 
Wait, have I been here? Oh yeah, I guess I have. I was like, dude, oh my god, I thought I was gonna die right there. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna come back. I'm just gonna remember, hopefully, that I didn't explore all of that cave back there, because that does go on for quite some time. Quite a while. Actually, I'm gonna get the rest of this. I don't know why I didn't the first time. I think there might be lava under this. Nope. All right. Where did I come in at? Somewhere over here, right? See? I hate that! They just fall from the ceiling. And if you're, like, right next to them, it'll blow up, like, right beside you, and you won't even stand a chance. Oh, that's why I hate creepers, dude. See, look, there's another one! Where did you even come from? Oh, here's where I came from. Okay. Alright. I'm gonna make myself a diamond pickaxe so I can get some obsidian while I'm down here. Alright, let's go back up to the surface. Alright, so we're back to the surface. Got myself some 14 obsidian. I need another chest, bro. We're gonna get four. That'll make me, what, two chests? Yep. And then I'm going to smelt this stuff, and then I'm going to smelt some cobble, get us some stone bricks, and then we'll start building up this. And yeah, so I'll be back with you guys once all that is smelted. Alright, we're back. Um, yeah, as you can see, got myself a farm going on back here. Got myself some sugar cane for books for an enchanting table later on. Got all my furnaces around. Um, got my chest full of cobble, chest full of junk with more cobble in it for some reason. Uh, throw all that in there. Chest. Yeah, I haven't actually emptied these in a while. Alright, so the main part of this video is done. Now, I know the top doesn't look pretty. I don't plan on keeping it like this for long. I'm just going to keep it like this for the time being. But, yeah, the wall is done. And, believe it or not, this took me, like, well over two or three hours to do. <laughs> it took a lot longer than I anticipated, because I needed a lot more stone than I thought I would have, and that's not supposed to be like that. Let's make this perfect. There we go. I thought I got all the rough patches. I guess I missed a few. Yeah, all right, I got the rest of them. But yeah, this wall is... Actually, I'm going to go sleep before I do that. But yeah, so... Um, the wall... I think it actually turned out pretty nice. I ended up making both sides even because I tried to just do the sloppy look because I was like... Tried to go for the whole I don't care vibe and make it look sloppy. But it really bugged me, so I ended up just taking down this side and making it even with this side. So now, if I can go back far enough, I can get a good view. These trees are in the way, but you get the gist. Like, it's even on both sides, except for this water pillar here. But I'll get rid of that once I uh, have an entrance to the top and bottom. But yeah, what I was thinking is maybe making, like, leveling this out a little bit. Because I did level out, level it out a little already over there but I'm thinking maybe leveling it out to here or something with a shovel and then like making a door here because this goes all the way down there but this only goes up to like there so I don't know I'm gonna make a door somewhere and then make the inside like its own thing like a castle type vibe maybe and then have a building up top maybe like a little house or something but yeah so either that or I'm gonna make a staircase that goes up and around. But I'm not entirely sure with that yet. We're going to save that for a future episode. But yes, I'm very happy with how this turned out. I think it looks amazing, and it took a lot of effort, but I think it was worth the effort. Oh, and another thing. So 1.18 1 just came out in between recording sessions. And I already tested to see if this world is up to date. It is down here in my mine. 
Actually, I'm going to go down here so I can show you guys how much mining I did. So I will be back in just a second. So here at the bottom of this, I have a little water thing so I can just fall instead of coming down all these steps. But yeah, so I got this little mine going here. And I already tested to see if this goes down past zero, and it does. It does go past zero. They replaced all the bedrock with deep slate, so that probably goes down deeper to like the deep dark or whatever. And then this just goes on for a while. And where I got majority of my stone is all the way here in the back. I mined out this little section for some stone. Then here's the big part. I mined out this entire section for stone. And I now that I'm looking at it, it doesn't actually look that big. But it did. It took a lot of mining. I probably went through maybe like six or seven iron pickaxes mining this out. And I explored all of this over here, this ravine. I'll, I'll um, include bits and pieces of that. Because I found a few diamonds around, like here and there. I think one of the times I found diamonds was like right here. I think there was a set of diamonds right there or something. Um, but yeah, and then there's a few caves I explored that were attached to this, like this one that goes down there for quite some time. And I didn't even explore all of that. This actually goes to an even bigger cave system that I didn't get to explore yet. And that's not even point of one po part of 1.18 yet, so, uh, my world should be updated in the chunks that I haven't explored, which is a majority of them. I haven't explored a whole lot left in this world, which I'm glad I didn't because I didn't even know 1.18 was coming out this soon. Otherwise, I wouldn't have even started this world, to be honest with you. But I did. I did it anyways. And yeah, so I need to go and explore those chunks and find some new caves and some new mountains and stuff. And yeah, I look forward to doing that. Oh, and I, uh, yeah, like I said, I, down there I found a few diamonds. I, f I ended up finding 19 diamonds. I don't think I was recording for some of them, and I know that sounds super cliche, but uh, I was recording for, I know, for at least the first set, and maybe a few sets after that, but I will re include those recordings in the video, and um, show you my reactions to getting the diamonds, because I know my first reaction was really cheesy, it was like, I literally was the interpretation of that video from years ago, of like, ooh, diamonds, you know, like, ah! Okay, we're, we're okay. Yeah, that, that's happened before. Luckily, I never died by any of them. But it's always been a close call. <laughs> See, that's why I have that water thing over there. So, like, when I need to get down, I can just go down the freaking water. But, yeah, as I was saying, I found diamonds, and then I had that cliche reaction of, like, ooh, diamonds, you know, and I'm like, it's just really cheesy because I watched it back already and it's it's just so cheesy. But yeah, I I hope you guys don't mind the cheesiness because I'm a cheesy person, I guess. <laughs> but anyways, that's going to do it for this episode. Um, I see a nice little cliff over there. I kind of like how that looks because it looks like it's like over some water or something, even though I can't see that far. But yeah, that's going to be it for this episode. Um... Episode 3 will be in production soon. I don't know if I'm going to make another video on a different game before that. But if I do, well then, I will. But if I don't, well then, be on the lookout for Episode 3. Because I am actually looking forward to making it. I don't know what I'm going to do. I think what I'm going to do in Episode 3 for sure is make like a little stone like brick balcony here. So this comes out a little bit and then like got supports and stuff. I think that'll look pretty cool. Uh, maybe interpret some wood in here so it gives it a little contrast but uh, if I do that I might use dark oak I'm not entirely sure but uh, yeah so that's the plan and then I might start a layout for my house I'm not entirely sure yet but you know we're just gonna go by year we're just gonna do it and get it done but yeah, if you enjoyed, please do consider liking and subscribing. It would mean the absolute world to me. Um, I do appreciate the support. And if you like the Minecraft content, uh, just let me know in the comments and give me some recommendations for what you think I should build, what you think I should do, and all that jazz. Just, just let me know. Uh, yeah, that'll be it. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye. Yeehaw.